Watching 7 Action News, always taking action for you. Well, one of the busiest roads in Detroit has been a danger zone since Monday, and for a mind boggling reason, the traffic lights aren't working. We are talking about Jefferson Avenue, the road Mayor Duggan takes to work. And just to be clear now, this is four days with no traffic lights. 7 Action News reporter Ronnie Dahl is on a mission to get them fixed, and she joins us now live. Ronnie. Yeah, we're talking about a half mile stretch here, starting at Mount Elliott, going up to Joseph Campo. Take a look behind me. They've been working on it. The light is flashing right now. I can tell you this is dangerous. While we've been out here today, we saw a couple close calls, and we're told some cars even crashed because of this problem. The city of Detroit's known about it for a couple of days, but it appears like they didn't really start to take this serious until we got on the story earlier today. Drive this stretch of East Jefferson near downtown Detroit, and you hear a lot of horns honking. That's because for the past few days, the traffic lights have been out, and drivers don't seem to know what to do. Yesterday, there was uh, multiple accidents that happened outside because of uh, all the lights being off outside. That's crazy. Yeah, I know. Tell me about it. We arrived at the intersection of East Jefferson and Mount Elliott and spotted a City of Detroit crew. We wanted to ask the workers when they expected the lights to be operational again. But when they saw us, they took off. When we tried to follow, they hit the neighborhood, going up and down side streets to lose us. So we gave up and went back to ask Detroiters what they think. How long do you think it should take them to be fixed? It's pretty soon. Pretty soon. Top priority? Yeah. This is a major road. How quick do you think they should have those lights fixed? As soon as the problem started. Mm -hmm. If not now, it should have already been done. Guess the workers figured out they couldn't avoid us. They eventually returned to the intersection to tackle repairs, and we were there. We don't want to chase you through the neighborhood. You're going to get the lights on by the end of the day? So what took the city of Detroit so long to address the problem? Even Mayor Duggan knew the lights were out. He takes this route to get to work. We have a water main that has broken. The water has seeped into the main into the manholes. It has uh, affected uh, the trunk line that supplies power to not only street lights but also to traffic signals. And so we have PLD on site as we speak. We've hired a contractor who is also on site. They're in the hole. They're splicing the cable. They're going to make the repair. And they are still working on those repairs right now. Real quick, I have a number I want to pass along to you. If you do notice a traffic signal out in the city of Detroit, there's a number you can call, 313-224-0500. Help the city out so they can get this problem fixed. Out here tonight, we are seeing some Detroit police officers helping with traffic control. For now, we are live in Detroit. Back to you. Good work. Way to stay with it, Ronnie. Thanks so much.